a weird day this has been. It all started when we woke up on the living room floor. And it got even weirder once we left the house. Well, showing off our new clothes wasn't weird. It was pretty cool. But then this freaky futuristic cell phone thingy went off, and this old guy we'd never seen before told us that we were spies. As if. So I threw the device out, and we went for lunch. And that's when we were so rudely attacked. And even though we escaped, our lives still seem to be in danger. Like, like what, what is, is going, going on, on here? here? So tell me again why we're going through the garbage? We're not. Clover is. Because she's the one that threw out the weird cell phone thingy in the first place. Hey, don't blame me. I didn't know what it was. Still, if we want to get in touch with that old guy, we're gonna need it. This is so unfair and so gross. Looks like it's been emptied out. <laughs> yeah! Can we go home now? We're in danger, Clover. We have to find that cell phone, even if it means going through every garbage can at school. Okay, I am swimming around in garbage, my outfit is ruined, and I smell horrible. Could this day get any worse? <laughs> I knew this is where you got your luck! What do you want, Mandy? Oh, nothing! Now that I've seen you like this, my year is complete! No! <laughs> This is quickly becoming the worst day of my life! Oh, I know it is, but you can't give up, Clover! Sammy's right! You gotta give us one more dumpster dive! <sighs> Fine, but you girls owe me some serious pamper points. <gasps> hey! I found it! Great! Now let's just make the call and get our lives back to normal! Maybe it works on voice commands! Open! Please open! I said open up! Okay, now you're just being difficult. It probably needs a more delicate touch. Yeah. Bingo! I knew they would call back. Sam! Clover! Alex! Er, uh, old guy? Listen carefully, girls. You may be in great danger. May? We were just attacked at lunch. Yeah, there was a crazy waiter and a freaky waitress and this really creepy guy. They totally ruined our sushi. Three people attacked you? It must be the Lamos. It was a pretty lame lunch. Not lame, Lamos. The league aiming to menace and overthrow spies. Sadly, their leader is my brother Terence, and he will stop at nothing to defeat us. Girls, it is imperative that you get me out of this submarine. I don't know. Submarine rescues aren't really our thing. Yeah, we usually hang out at the groove after school. And besides, how do we know that we can trust you? I mean, we just met you today. Actually, Sam, we've known each other for quite a while. This was taken at the Whoop picnic. We went to a picnic? How uncool is that? Hey, that's my favorite purse! And those are the shoes I wore all last summer! As I told you earlier, you girls are super spies! So how come we can't remember anything about it? It's your new bracelets. They've erased part of your memory. An evil fashion accessory? <laughs> yeah, right. And to think I was actually starting to buy what that old guy was selling. Please, call me Jerry. <laughs> uh, girls? Old guy, I mean, Jerry, just might be onto something. My bracelet won't come off. You must hurry, girls. The submarine is filling with water. So, what do you think? Oh, what the heck? There's nothing good on TV tonight anyway. Excellent. Only one prob. What do we know about being spies? Oh, don't worry about that. As always, you'll find Gladys to be a tremendous help. Gladys? Who's Gladys? Welcome back to Whoop, Agents. I wonder if there's a movie on this flight.
Forget seeing a movie. It's like we're in one. Since you have no memory of being spies, ah! I should remind you of a few things. I am Gladys, and I am head of Whoop. I thought that was Jerry's job. Oh, I just let Jerry tell people he's in charge. It makes him feel important. In that case, do we really have to save him? I'm afraid so. But before you do, you'll need a few things. An important part of every spy mission is the gadgets. No spy ever embarks without them. Big deal. I already have a nail file. Does your nail file do this? No, it doesn't do that. Next is the bubble protection bubble gum. Is it sugar free? No, but it's completely waterproof. And finally, your jetpacks. Okay, now I feel like a real spy! There's still one more thing. You need your outfits. Yeah! yeah! Awesome! I've so got to get one of those for my bedroom. And I so love this outfit. How did you know yellow is my color? You told us. Now please put on your jetpacks. It's time to rescue Jerry. Three super spies ready for action. <laughs> Good, because we're over the target area. Get ready to jump. As if! Forget it! <gasps> no way! Ah, oh, I hoped it wouldn't come to this. We're here! Now how are we going to get inside? Easy! We use the laser nail file. Okay, but be careful where you point that thing. Now that's what I call a serious grooming tool. Okay! We really should have thought this one through a little better! If we don't fix this leak ASAP, the sub is going straight to the bottom of the ocean! I've got an idea! Take off your helmets! Uh, you sure that's the best plan, Sammy? Yeah! I don't want to risk drowning or getting my hair wet for no reason! Trust me! It's the best way to cover the hole! We're pretty good at this. Maybe we are spies after all. Girls, please hurry! Did somebody call for a rescue team? I knew I could count on you. Now would you mind untying me? The ropes are beginning to chafe. Okay, but you better not try anything funny. Ah, free at last. Now, let's get out of here before Terence finds out what we're up to. Too late for that! You good guys are so predictable. Hey, it's the Lamos guys we beat up at the sushi spa. 
It would seem, Jerry, that I'm going to have the pleasure of dispatching you and your star spies at the same time. Did you hear that? He just called us star spies. We must be good. But not good enough. We beat you once, and we're going to do it again. Ah! <laughs> Ow. Did you teach her that one, dear brother? Yeah! Now it's time to bust a move! Mm. Oh, round and oh, round oh, you go! Oh, ah. oh, I'm not feeling so good. I really don't want to fight you. Good. That'll make this very easy. Ah. 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 Oh. I thought I trained them better than this. It looks like I've finally won. Not so fast, Terence. I'm not going down without a fight. Ah, yes, you are. Oh, oh, oh. Soon, the submarine will be completely filled with water. And then it's going to sink into a shark feeding area. Chompy, chompy! <sighs> Have a nice demise. We'll be sure to leave all the hatches open on the way out. <laughs> Wouldn't want to make those hungry sharks wait too long for the next meal. <laughs> 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 <Yeah>. <laughs> A few hours ago, we were just normal students. Now we're about to become shark food. And what's worse, we risked our lives for a guy who isn't even the head of Whoop. I beg your pardon? Oh, it's okay, Jerry. Gladys told us that she's the real boss. But I'm the head of Whoop. Gladys is my assistant. Well, it doesn't really matter now. We're finished. That's not what I taught you. I taught you girls that there's always a way out. And you were the best students I ever trained. Sam, you've always used your keen deductive logic to figure out difficult clues. And Alex, your athletic ability is second to none. Um, <clears throat> and? And? Oh, <laughs> yes, of course. Clover, uh, basically, when you're a spy, you're the same as you are in your regular life. What's that supposed to mean? Uh, I, I mean, whether you're a spy or, or whether you're a student. Your creativity is second to none. Well, that's pretty cool, I guess. If only you could get those bracelets off. Then you'd be able to think like the spies that you are. Hey, check it out! My bracelet is rusting! Ah, low rent much. We are so getting a refund on these. Totally! Aha! The salt water must be causing the clasp to corrode. Quick, girls, put your bracelets back under water. He's right! No way! We are spies! Welcome back, ladies. Okay, anyone else ready to wipe out the Lamos once and for all? Yeah, but first I need a little help over here. No problem. I can remember all our training, even the class on knots. Yeah, we kind of skipped that class. Well, you never said we'd be tested on it. Yeah! All right! Yeah! Unfortunately, we've sunk too deep to swim to the surface. <gasps> the torpedo tube! All we have to do is shoot ourselves out of here! Woo! <laughs> I don't suppose anyone has a more comfortable idea. <sighs> Gladys, bring the jet to pick up all four of us. We'll be at the surface in a few seconds. <laughs> now 
now to get our hands on Terence. Any idea where he might be heading? To where? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> it's a full house, boss. The Whoop agents are all here. Perfect. Lucky you saved that mask. Indeed. Now to destroy Whoop. Agents, I'll be brief. Each of you has just been given the latest communication device from the lab. And as of this moment, it is standard issue for all Whoop agents. So please put on your new bracelets. Thank you. <laughs> now, I just need to be certain that you girls are ready to take on the Lamos. Um, we can't attack you, Jerry. Oh, come now, girls. Just pretend that I'm Terence. Hi -ya! No! Who? Oh! No! Oh! oh. You're ready. What is this place? Oh, I don't know, but I'm not sticking around to find out. It's working, Terence. They're all going home. Brilliant. Now get ready to witness the dawn of a new era in evil. With Whoop neutralized, nothing can stop us. Surprise. This wasn't part of the plan. I am too close to success. I will not be stopped. There's no way. Way? Get rid of them. But my bracelets, they were perfect. <laughs> yeah, perfectly cheap. As in next time you're looking to create memory erasing jewelry, you might want to consider silver. Now, get ready for the big payback! it, Terence. You'll never win. This is the end of the Lamos. I beg to differ, brother. Okay, Jerry. We're ready to put him away for you. No, girls. This is a family matter. I'll handle it myself. Bring it on, Terence. No. Why don't you bring it on? Come on, Jer. Finish him already. Go. Uh, uh, He's going down any second. Uh, now. Not likely. You're going down. I've got you right where I want you. No, I've got you right where I want you. This is the end of the line, Terence. <laughs> yeah! You know, I was going to beat him. We know, but it's been a really long day and we so want to go home. <laughs> Thanks to you girls, the Lamos has finally been eliminated. And with their bracelets removed, all of our agents are back to normal. I'm gonna make sure these bracelets are never used again.
good, because it was way weird not being able to remember being a spy. Yeah, it was like we were totally missing something exciting in our lives. I guess that as much as we sometimes complain, the truth is we really like being spies. I'm glad you feel that way. And to thank you for defeating the Lamos, I'm taking you out shopping. And believe it or not, Whoop will pay for everything. <gasps> Did I say we like being spies? I meant we love it! One thing before we leave. Gladys, I expect all of the paperwork on this case to be on my desk by the time we get back. But that's not my department. Quite the contrary. As the head of Whoop, it is part of your job. You are so busted. <laughs> <laughs> As times change, a spy must always fit in with the current trends. Back in the 1960s, we spies went for the super swinging look. A few years later, the look was super cool. Not long ago, spies perfected the super slick look. Perhaps my current look is one that is most fitting for a spy. <laughs>